we'll go ahead and click on 1536. It goes black. And now the mountains are clear. They're very clear. All right, guys, I have something that I've been working on for two to three weeks. I'm very excited about releasing it now. Um, it is an app. You can find the link in the video description that you can use to change your resolution from within Oculus Go. In fact, you can use it inside Oculus TV. It will show up, and when you click on it, it will instantly you can instantly see the res resolution change. The screen flashes black for about a second. And if you look at the mountains, you can see them change. Um, it usually works the first time. Sometimes you have to click it a second time, but other than that, it works fine. Um, you do have to be running ADB on TCP IP port 5555. Um, that's it for everybody who knows how that works. Uh, for the rest of you guys, you wanna see a tutorial, you wanna see it, it uh, you wanna see a demonstration, Keep watching. Also remember any settings that you set, any resolution settings you change with these apps will reset back to default when you restart your Go. One thing I do want to mention before we get into it is that every time you restart your Oculus Go, you will need to reconnect it to your computer in order to restart ADB and TCP IP mode. Number one. Number two, if the apps don't seem like they're working, make sure you don't have anything else connected to port 5555 via ADB and TCP IP mode because I used to connect a lot to my Go over TCP IP and when I was trying these apps a bunch of times they weren't working and I was like why aren't they working and that's when I realized I was connected and they weren't working so um, make sure you're not connected nothing else is connected to that port um, and like if, if you are on your computer you just disconnect ADB space disconnect is the command it will disconnect and then you can use them all right, let's get into the tutorial. All right, the first thing you need to do after you sideload those APKs um, is you need to connect your Go if it's not already connected. And then enable ADB over TCP IP on port 5555. So here we go here, ADB, TCP IP, 5555. And this has to be running in the same directory that your ADB executable is in. Unless, of course, you have ADB in your system path. Sometimes you have to do it twice. Restarting in TCP mode, port 5555. Now you can disconnect and you are able to use those apps. You could also do it with ADB link. Click on utility, click on wireless ADB and that would say off and you click on it and it would turn it on but it says disabled because this is disconnected watch connect it again utility wireless adb see it's enabled so from within oculus tv these each app will show up each app is for a separate resolution and you can click on them and the screen will go black for a second like right now i changed it to 512 512 is great for verifying that it works. You can see the mountains are pretty blurry. We'll go ahead and click on 1536. It goes black. And now the mountains are clear. They're very clear. Uh, you can go to 2048. More clear. You can go to 2560, although some things start to lag at 2560. Oculus TV starts to lag a little bit. Um, again, if you go back to 512, if you go back to 512, you can see, if you go back to 512, you can see uh, everything's blurry and it works fine. Um, there's a couple of other utilities I put in here which will increase your recording size. Well, this one will. Uh, recording 1536, that will change your recording size because uh, the default recording size is 1024 by 1024. If you click on this one, it'll change it to 1536 by 1536. Gives you a little bit more resolution for your recordings if that's something you're interested in. And, uh, and that's about it. 
Set this back to default 1024. 1024 is the default uh, texture resolution uh, for the Oculus Go. So uh, that's it. Hope you guys enjoy these utilities. It took me two or three weeks to get them working properly. And uh, all right, if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. If you don't like it, give it a thumbs down. Um, subscribe if you liked it. And uh, I'll talk to you guys later.